For 6,000 children have been put on a waiting list for child care assistance in Louisiana. The Louisiana House has cut funding for early childhood education and is expected to use those funds for other entities. NBC 10's Hannah Clark has more details on this story. I spoke with local owner here at Tender Touch Nursery, and she says this not only affects her business, but it also affects the children that she helps educate. The house has cut $24 million from the program's budget, which leaves low-income families at risk to lose child care assistance or to be put on a wait list. Child care assistance is to allow families or single parents the opportunity to provide their children with quality education while maintaining a job. We've dealt with parents who had to quit their jobs because they, they just can't pay the, the child care. And us as providers, we're put in a position of how long can we keep a child who's not paying. The money taken from the budget will be used to fund public school systems, state prisons, and police. Not to take away from those entities, but Rogers says as a child care provider, she believes this is not a good use of the funds. And it starts from birth. And I feel like if we invest more into our children from birth, um, that we, would we would see a better uh, improvement with our child children in their development as far as when they start school when they're going through school so when they come to us in child care we lay that foundation louisiana has been pushing for quality child care but it is hard to maintain due to lack of funding it's going to mean losing even more teachers because we won't have the funding to be able to pay and give raises to the teachers Child care is expensive for even the normal household, costing up to $800 a month for one child. Families could lose child care, and child care centers will have to find ways to raise money in order to stay open. Reporting from Rabel, Louisiana, for your Arklamas News Source, I'm Hannah Clark.